super calorific exvialidocious? <laughs> Hello everyone. Thank you for joining me today. Thank you for clicking that link. I am down to 229 pounds and having just said that right at the beginning I feel like maybe I should put that at the end and make you wait through the rest of the video to find out. <laughs> but there you are, 229 pounds today. So I'm down. That's awesome. I'm doing awesome. I hope you're doing awesome. I bet you are. And I kind of wanted to touch today on the fast food salad. Yes, so if you're an old hand to dieting, you know, eh, they might not be the best. You might, calorically speaking, it might not be the best thing to get. Um, so for instance, if you went to McDonald's and you got the Southwest Buttermilk Crispy Chicken Salad, that's 520 calories. As opposed to, say, like the filet of fish sandwich, which is 490 calories. And I'm comparing these to things that I would probably get. So if you order something else from fast food, um, your mileage may vary, but this is just stuff that I would get from fast food. If I was eating fast food, which I'm not eating fast food anymore. No, I'm just kidding. Um, so another culprit. Another one that you want to watch out for is the spicy chicken Caesar salad from Wendy's. And I find that sealer, sealer? Caesar salads are a little caloric. Um, they, they are usually kind of costly. You know, you've got the cheese and the croutons and the, the dressing all kind of, kind of adds up. It's a, it's a little rough. So for that one, it's 720 calories. Whereas if I decided to get a Baconator Junior, that's 630 calories, which I would definitely want to eat the Baconator, <laughs> the Junior, the Junior Baconator. Um, and this isn't including fries or any or other options. You know, if you get like more cheese or more bacon on the Baconator, that's not including that. So another one that you might want to watch out for is the Bacon Cheddar Ranch Chicken Salad from Burger King. Um, and that one comes in at a whopping 720 calories, as opposed to, say, getting a Whopper, which is 660 calories. Depends on what you want to eat there. <laughs> I really am not that much of a fan of Burger King anymore, so... Um, and then, another one you can want, just, just for comparison, you know, everybody goes to Subway to eat a healthy sandwich, Sometimes you're probably going to get the salad. Well, the chicken and bacon ranch salad from Subway is a grand total of 540 calories, as opposed to, say, the Italian BMT sandwich, which is 410. So you might think you're doing something good for yourself and getting the healthy salad, but in reality, you might not be. You might be better off to go with a burger. Now I'm not condoning getting a burger versus a salad. I am just trying to illustrate it. If you, you know, if you're in a pinch and your coworkers are like, "Hey, let's go to McDonald's," then you'll know. Hey, maybe I shouldn't get the salad. Or what I like to do sometimes is I just get the salad, but I don't put all the things on it. You know, if it comes with a packet of of dressing and the croutons and the cheese, maybe I'll just put like the cheese on it. And then maybe just a smidge of the dressing because I don't I don't draw my salad and dressing anyway because dressing is amazingly calorific <laughs> super califral cal eh. what is it super now it's gonna drive me crazy super califragilistic expialidocious super calorific expialidocious I don't know I know I'm weird but <laughs> just just letting you guys no to watch out for the fast food salad thanks for watching everyone i hope to see you back here next week i hope you have a good week i hope you get reach your goals of working out or um, eating healthy or drinking more water or reading more books or whatever it is that you're trying to accomplish bye